Well, brand new tonight, an accidental discovery is promising news for people who turn to Botox for cosmetics re cosmetic reasons or for the relief of medical problems. A local doctor uncovered a groundbreaking link between zinc levels and the effects of Botox. Local 2's Lauren Freeman shows us how this connection can make the injections last 30% longer. Most of us know Botox as a beauty enhancement, erasing the lines of age, leaving the smooth-looking skin of youth. But for thousands, it is a sanity-saving treatment for very real medical conditions. In 2001, I went to work with my eyes taped open. I took medical tape and taped my eyelids to my eyebrows. Wesley Polk could hardly drive, work, or even see because of his severe eye spasms. They'd get the spasms so much and blinking that I couldn't control them and they would shut and I couldn't open them. Diagnosed with blepharo disease, Wesley has spent the last decade coming to Dr. Charles Soparker for Botox treatments four times a year, but not anymore. I get it every two to three months, and then with the new pills I have, I'm taking it every five to six months. Dr. Soparker is not just a world-renowned oculoplastic surgeon, he's also a biochemist. After noticing some patients were not as receptive to Botox, a resident asked if it could be diet. He started to think on a molecular level. All the botulinum toxins are zinc-dependent metalloproteases, which means they require zinc. No zinc, they don't work. He says about 50% of the population is zinc deficient. So we asked the question. What would happen if we gave people zinc before their toxins and Zytase was born. 92% of people in our study had an increase in effect. Now with this new pill I can, I can drive again. The Zytase is taken four days before Botox and the day of the treatment. Well, he does it on my forehead, my eyes, my chin, and my underneath my nose. Dr. Soparker essentially uncovered a new and very positive side effect of getting zinc levels under control. The Botox effects last longer, which means fewer shots and less money spent. It even works for people like Karen Williams, who are just using it for a fresher look. Four months was my routine every four months for eight years and I started taking the Zytase and um, noticed that I could stretch it out to six months um, to eight months. Very happy with the results and even happier now that I can stretch it out. Dr. Soparker says because it's only taken right before the injections you don't have to worry about getting too much zinc. It's prescription only and some insurance companies are paying for it before medical Botox treatments. Lauren Freeman, KPRC, Local 2. Now, this isn't the first revolutionary discovery for Dr. So Parker. He says he's also created a product that can undo the permanence of wrinkle fillers like Restylane and Juvederm when a patient isn't happy with the results.